Living Local Carolina with Katie Turner. Local trends, shopping, dining, and more. This is Living Local Carolina. This story is sponsored by Morris Law, LLC. I always wanted to help people. I wanted to do something that would help folks make the choices that affected their everyday life. The main goal of Morris Law is to help people get their life back after an accident. Typically our clients are going through one of the worst times of their life. They've been injured through no fault of their own, through someone's negligence or carelessness. They're often hurting physically, hurting financially. Just because you hire a lawyer or just because you have health insurance doesn't mean that you won't get medical bills associated with your accident. Why do I owe $4,000 to the hospital when my health insurance should have paid? How does it work with the hospital and all of these injuries and how much time they have to spend in the hospital? You have to tell them that everything is going to be okay, regardless of what happens with this ambulance bill, regardless of what happens with this hospital bill. It's all going to work out. As an attorney, you're not going to let those medical providers take all of their settlement money. You negotiate that for them. You're still going to get money in your pocket for your injuries. After an accident, one of the biggest problems clients face is getting the health care they need. We want your entire focus to be on getting better. We want to take over not only the heavy lifting, but all the technical issues of trying to push your claims through. If it ends up in trial, making sure that all of that is taken care of so you can continue to focus on your treatment. We have attorneys that I knew for the whole time I've been practicing law. Ian was my first friend as an attorney when I started practicing. Lee and I went to law school together. We really are all friends outside of this practice. We meet with our clients together, we try cases together, and so we are a small knit group and we know our clients. I was test driving a car and I'm coming up to the light and there's a car coming across over to another road. She didn't see me, I didn't see her, and we kind of collided. I was in a lot of pain. I couldn't really do anything, bills was piling up. I didn't know what, what was going to happen. The girl of the car, she didn't have no insurance. She didn't have a license. I knew right away that I needed an attorney. The company that I was going to buy the car from, he referred me to Jeff. I called him and said, hey, I was in an accident. Can you help me out? He told me that I was in good hands. I wouldn't have to worry about anything and they kept in touch with me on everything. I never had to contact them, email them, call them, or anything. And I loved them for that day. I felt like they were my family when I went there. Like they really showed me love. What makes the Morris Law Firm unique is the collaboration that we have between our attorneys and our staff here. Jeff, Ian, and I are a team. We're bringing the big law firm feel to a small law firm. You know, some clients will go to other firms and they only talk to paralegals, they only talk to staff. They've never once talked to an attorney. Our policy is that you're going to talk to an attorney on day one. Morris, his background comes with a strong drive. He understands the medical part more than anybody at this firm. Besides the attorneys, our staff is key. We design our firm so that each of the staff member has the same experience as we do. At Morris Law, all three attorneys go on every file. Every attorney will be involved in your case, and if your case goes to trial, you will get every attorney in Morris Law at that trial. Here at Morris Law, we want to get you more. We want to get you more in terms of service. We want to get you more in terms of legal representation. We want to get you more in terms of your case value. At Morris Law, we can't undo what happened, but we can help you get past it. We are going to help you. This story is sponsored by Morris Law, LLC.
We'll be back right after this break with more Living Local Carolina. Well, we have got our apron on today because we are at the Art Museum of Myrtle Beach. I'm joined by Colin. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing awesome. Let's go ahead and get into it. What All are right. we doing today? So today we have these stuffed paper sculptures of musical instruments. It's inspired by our exhibit, Lifting Black Voices. We have one of the galleries in the show has an um, entire uh, gallery full of um, paintings and artwork that is inspired by jazz and music. Mm -hmm. So. This is a pretty simple project, but still it gives you really cool results. So the first step for this is you're going to print out either some type of musical instrument, it could be whatever you'd like. We have some tubas here. And after you print them out, you're going to cut them out. And then you're going to get another sheet of paper and you're going to trace the outline of the instrument. Okay. So you just go around. And this, it doesn't have to be nice and neat, you can do it. A little quick, you can do a little sketchy, which I like to do. I'm very focused right now. Yeah. <laughs> I'm it's, glad you said it didn't have to be perfect. Yeah, sketching it, it takes a lot of focus, more focus than you think. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So, yeah, once you have that all sketched out, you'll end up cutting it out. Okay. But thankfully, we already have these two examples already cut out. Yay! <laughs> so, yeah, so. I can skip that step. Yay! <laughs> okay. So, yeah, uh, once you cut them out, you will have, of course, two pieces of paper. And what you want to do is first staple half the papers together. So, I did it kind of a little strategic spot so we can still kind of have some areas where we can uh, end up stuffing the paper in there. Uh, but so gotcha. I did some like at the top and I just did some of the sides too, leaving openings that up here and also two here at the bottom as well. But after you get it stapled together, you get to decorate it. And okay. Of course, this is completely up to the artist how you would want to decorate it using whatever colors, whatever types of patterns. It's completely right. up to you. Let's do it. sponsored by Practical Purpose Solutions. Thanks so much for being with us today on Living Local Carolina. I am at Practical Purpose Solutions. I'm joined by Kendra. How are you doing today, Kendra? I'm doing good. Okay, <laughs> we're talking about all of the different things that you guys have to offer here at Practical Purpose Solutions. Mm -hmm. It's a pretty long list. It is. <laughs> Why don't you give me some of your top things that you have here? So our top things, of course, we are the place where we consider to be where you come to reset and refocus. So mm -hmm. our top two is IV hydration therapy and weight loss management, of course, because we're all about the body enhancement and then we also have external services that are really good for people that need it for like work, like DOT physicals. We also mm -hmm. offer telehealth medicine. So if someone um, are not able to get to like the provider right away, some people love the conveniency of just having that reach and be able to pick up the phone and call. Um, they're able to do that as well. We are self-pay, but it's very beneficial to our clients because they get um, what they need in a, a short increment of time. Um, and then we do primary care as well. You guys do a little bit of everything. Mm -hmm. We do. <laughs> I can imagine you get a pretty good response too from people that come and yeah. they have no idea that you have off you're offering all these things. What's mm -hmm. that like? It's very different um, mm -hmm. because you know we try to tailor more to the two services that we kind of focus a lot on. But when they realize like we can offer them more than just that, um, they love it and they actually become like family. They're like calling mm -hmm. us for everything for their children. They're calling us, you know, whenever they have like some events in the community. They're like, can you come out do B12s? Can y'all come out and, you know, just do some things with our kids education wise. So yeah. I love it. Mm -hmm. Well. People can also come to different events that you guys have going on. Oh, yeah. You're always you always have something going on, you know. Yes, so we do always have something going on. We just locally had our um, Unstop She's Unstoppable event, which focused on mental, physical, and emotional and financial health. Um, really, really good. And so the events are tailored because we are a medical facility, mm -hmm. but our events are tailored to the whole body. So these are outlets for individuals to have where they can come in network or just to be in a safe space where they can let out. So we have caregiver nights, 
um, for people that deal with um, family members or you know loved ones that have to take care of you need an outlet and you'll leave walk out the doors and you'll feel better yes yes every love time <laughs> i love it well how can people get in contact with y'all um they're more than welcome to go to our website it's www.practicalpurposesolutions.com this story is sponsored by practical purpose solutions sponsored by Belfour. Well, welcome back to Living Local Carolina. Today I am at Belfour Property Restoration. I'm joined by Steve. How are you, Steve? I'm doing great, thank you. Wonderful. Tell me your story. How did you get involved with this company? So I grew up here in Myrtle Beach. I've been here since 74 and Tony moved across the street from me and it was kind of golf course conversation that started the conversations about me buying into full steam ahead. Mm. That was back in 2001. And look at you now. We have come a long way. We actually started out with eight employees. It was me and Tony and eight employees. And I actually was hired to do sales and marketing. Uh -huh. But the company grew so fast that I got into the production side and I've been doing production, I've, all of it ever since. A little bit of everything. A little bit of everything. So for somebody that might not know, what does Belfour do? So we specialize in insurance restoration. So if somebody's house gets damaged either by water or fire, we do mold remediation, we do a little biohazard cleanup. Um, anything that normally when the insurance company gets involved, we can get involved and help you guys out with it. So how far is your reach in terms of who, it, who you're able to help? So we concentrate in Ori, Georgetown, and Brunswick County. But now that we're Belfort, our reach is a little bit farther. So we go up into the Wilmington area, we go up to Florence, we are basically east of 95, and then Columbia takes care of west of 95. And we go down to McClellanville because Charleston comes up to McClellanville. Gotcha. And you mentioned it a little bit before, full steam ahead is what you guys used to be. Correct. And now you're Belfour. Tell me all about that. So in 2020, we were acquired by Belfour and uh, we've maintained the same employees that we've had. We Probably 70% of them are still here. You, you normally lose people, just normal attrition. So, and we use the same subcontractors we used before. Yeah, you like to support small businesses, right? We're supporting the same local small businesses that we did when we were full steam ahead. Very cool. Now, talk about the process when somebody gives you guys a call, you're able to come out, see what the damage is, and then come back here, and they're able to actually design. The whole nine yards. If, if you have a loss at your house in the middle of the night, you can call us and we will come out and respond. Say you get out of bed and you step into water, you can step into two inches of water if a supply of line breaks and we'll come out and take care of that. And then your next step normally is to contact your insurance company. So once you reach out to your insurance company, we'll meet with the insurance adjuster and make sure they see the same damage as we do. So everybody's on the same page. And then we can actually, uh, once we determine what is damaged after we dry the house out, you can come here to make selections. We have a beautiful showroom. You can do your floor coverings, your cabinets, paint colors, countertops here. And then if you don't like something we have here, we'll take you wherever you want to go to do some shopping. Awesome. Love that. Yeah. What would you say is the most rewarding part of this job? So for me, what keeps me around is when someone first has a loss and they don't know which way to go, it's the process of helping them through that process. Mm -hmm. So I like to show up at the house and they're kind of freaking out a little bit, which is yeah. what you do when you step out of water, into oh, yeah. water. And then we actually can help guide you through that process. And that's working with the people is my favorite part of the job. And I can imagine you've made some friends over the years and have lots of stories. I'll tell you, we have made friends. Uh, not only do they become customers, but a lot of them become friends also. And okay. we still do social things with a lot of those people that we've worked for. Yeah, how did, how did you get involved with Belfour in the first place? So, uh, probably 15 years ago, there was a loss in North Myrtle Beach. And uh, we were working on the loss, and we get a phone call that somebody from Belfour Property Restoration was going to come down and they might take the job from us. It was a $30,000 job, so it was a rather large job. And uh, the gentleman came in town, and uh, I met him, and we hit it off, and he let us do the repairs so they didn't bring Belfour in from Charleston. And since then, we've done four jobs for him personally. His, his mom and dad own the condo, 
That same condo is flooded three times. He had a condo in Tidewater that somebody drove a car into, and we did the work for him there. And then they actually used to have some jobs here in Myrtle Beach, and they would call us and ask us if we would help the customers out. So we built a great relationship with, with Belfour. This story is sponsored by Belfour. Don't forget to like our page on Facebook and follow us on Instagram and Twitter. How to use the QR code. Just open the camera app on your smartphone, iPad, or tablet. Point your device at the QR code so the QR code appears on your screen. Your device will recognize the QR code and show you a notification. Click that notification and you'll come to our website. Living Local Carolina, weekday mornings at 9.30 on WBTW News 13.